As we head into the holidays, many of us are getting ready for a much needed break, but some folks don't have that luxury, specifically patients who need life-saving blood transfusions. Here to tell us how you can help them is Samantha Bivens from the American Red Cross. Samantha, thanks for joining us today. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to be here. Of course, it's nice to have you. We're talking about something very important. We're talking about giving the ultimate donation this year, and this is a big way to do that. But let's talk about the need a little bit first. How often is blood needed in this country? Uh, it's actually constant. Mm -hmm. uh, it's one of those things where we are always uh, looking to feel, have our shelves filled at least for eight days for those emergencies and traumas that would be coming up. It's one of those things that it just never goes away. Uh, the more uh, you can give blood, mm -hmm. the more we can keep those shelves full, the more we can help people. Right, and who are the patients that, I mean, I mentioned one at the top, but what other types of patients require blood specifically? Newborns. Mm -hmm. Mothers, people suffering from emergency trauma, burn victims, cancer victims, anybody looking to have a surgery, whether it's scheduled or not, those are people that all require blood. Well, and we're talking about the demand, it's constant, like you say, but what does that translate in terms of people actually donating? Well, when you look at it that way, only about 10% of an eligible population will donate. So you got 100% of a population, 60% mm -hmm. cannot donate for some reason. 30% can, but only 10% of those do. So we're looking at 10% of people supporting about 90% of a population. So we're always looking for people to come out and roll up a sleeve, try it for the first time. It's really just a pinch and one pint saves up to three lives. One pint saves three lives and we were talking before the show and you mentioned something that w the reason why people don't do it will be shocking to some, like the, why they, most of them don't do it, which is what? They are never asked. Right. So we're sitting here asking, come on out, especially during the holiday seasons. This is when things get really tough. People are traveling. People are getting ready for their holidays. People are getting sick. Mm -hmm. So they're doing other things, but the need for blood doesn't. So while we receive drops, mm -hmm. what gets put, uh, what, what we're waiting for it right, <laughs> right. So, so let's talk about how people can help. We have the Scripps Blood Drive coming up. Tell us about yes, it. Yes, it's going to be an amazing drive. We're going to be here from 6 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Walk-ins are welcome. We do really hope, though, that people make appointments because appointments see priority. Mm -hmm. So they'll get in and get out, especially if they do their rapid pass. Takes about 40 minutes to donate a pint of whole blood. Uh, you do your rapid pass, you can cut off about 20 minutes, 15 minutes of that time. Come on in, get in and out in a jiffy. We've got a ton of incentives going on that day, raffles, prizes, food, lots of stuff going on all day long. Save up to three lives and then get right back to shopping for your Black Friday if that's what you want to do. There you go. And the best incentive, of course, is knowing that you're helping people. And you talk about the Rapid Pass, too. That's available in the app that you yes. can download? Yes. Yes. Our blood donor app. It, we won awards for it. You can sign up for that. It's free. It'll tell you when you can donate. It'll tell you your blood type. If you don't know your blood type, you can still come donate. We'll type you for you. And if you, uh, and then it can tell you maybe where your blood goes. And, it, and then you can do your rapid pass, which is just, if you've never donated before, that 40 minutes, about 30 minutes of it is answering a bunch of questions and things. So you do your rapid pass before you come donate, and then you'll, those, all those questions are in there, and then you can just jump right in and give blood, takes the actual donation piece, takes about five to 10 minutes, on your way, have some snacks. There you go, but if yeah. you can't donate blood, there's also a way, and in the last few seconds we have left, left, people can still help. Yes, volunteering. We also, we're also always looking for blood donors, ambassadors. We are also always looking for people to host blood drives. If you can't donate, the next best thing to do is to help us find people who can. Well, it's very simple to get involved with the Red Cross. Save lives. I mean, it'll take at most 40 minutes of your life to save all these lives. So, mm -hmm. Samantha, thank you so much for joining us. Today. Thanks for having me. Of course. Now, we could really use your help this Friday, guys. It's the Scripps Media Black Friday Blood Drive taking place from 6 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. at 7280 East Rosewood Street. That's the studios here. To learn more, please visit redcrossblood.org or call 1-800-733-2767. Now, although walk-ins are welcome, you can also pre-register and reserve a time slot for donation by visiting kgon9.com and, of course, by getting that app.